Hi, it's Andrea Dancing Star. Let's read cards for the astrological sign of Aries. Let's see what's going on with Aries. What is Aries' energy right now? 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 There we go. Eight of Swords. Reversed. That's kind of awesome. And the Fool is on the bottom of the deck. Starting something brand new. Wanting to, like, getting themselves out of feeling trapped in their anxieties. What else is going on for Aries? What else is going on for Aries? Like this. Like this. Okay, Four of Swords reversed. And then also the Four of Pentacles. Oh, and the Seven of Swords. Fantastic. I mean, not really, but you know. <laughs> but you know. People are going to do what they're going to do. So that's definitely, um, that's stealing. That's deception. That guy is clearly running away with everybody's sword. Uh, the thing is, um, Aries is unable to rest. And they're unable to rest because they don't have um, a very strong foundation. I don't know, like the foundation of their home is shaken up. They don't, they don't really, they don't have that security. They don't have a stable foundation. So they can't really rest. They would like to rest, but they can't. They can't because they're trying to get away with some stuff. They don't have, why, why, are, what are they trying to steal? What are they trying to steal? Eight of Cups, Knight of Cups Reverse, Empress. Okay, there you go. Someone walked away from Aries. They're trying to steal them back. They're trying to steal them back. Somebody walked away from Aries and they're trying to steal them back. It's just like a tiny bit gusty today. just a little bit. Okay. Ten of Cups and the Four of Wands. <sighs> it's like Aries has realized that they want a happy home. They've realized that they want to move into this happy home. They found something that they want um, and they're going to try to steal it back. They're trying to get it back. They're, well, how are they trying to steal this back? How are they trying to steal this family in this new home situation? How? Tell me more. Ace of Wands reversed. Hanged Man. Can't really take any action on it. Oh. Wheel of Fortune, Hanged Man, Death reversed. Oh. I think that this is a happy home that Aries had at one point in time. And I think that somehow it got shaken up. And I think that they're just desperate to try to make it come back. They're desperate to try to make it the foundation that it was. To make it the happy home that it was at one point in time. They lost it somehow. How did the Aries lose this? How did Aries lose all of this? How did Aries lose this? This isn't something new. This is something that they want back. Um, death sideways. Oh. Three of Swords. Someone was cheating. Someone was cheating. Someone couldn't transform this cheating situation. Someone couldn't get over it. Someone couldn't forgive this cheating situation. Ah, there was a lot of love there, too. There was a lot of love whenever they cheated. It's like, I don't know, it's almost like Aries was in a relationship with someone and maybe the other person cheated on someone. But the thing is, it wasn't just sex for that person. They really loved them. I mean, that's a mess. Let's see. Ten of Pentacles reversed. The Emperor. Aries Taurus energy. 
King of Wands reversed. A lot of Aries energy again, but using sex to get what they want. Only caring about themselves. Only caring about if people love them. No one else. This guy doesn't... This guy just wants people to want him. He just wants people to love him. He doesn't really care if it like... He doesn't really care if it's true or if it's real. He just wants the attention. You know, he just wants the attention to be showered with the attention and told that they love him, that, that you know, he, that he's loved. He doesn't really care if it's real. Three of Pentacles, King of Cups, and the Hermit. Okay, so Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy right here, loving father energy. Um, and then Hermiting. It's kind of like there's this, I don't know, there's this father figure energy he's he's working together he's working together he was part of this project some kind of a new business a new a new like maybe even going to school he was he was helping to build this situation i mean it kind of looks like we had the emperor and then we have three kings oh no we have the king of wands and the king of cups I mean, is this, is this a two man relationship or is this like, um, a man who is very loving and passive possibly has a family, uh, and then also possibly Aries takes a lot of action, but it's very like masculine action and it's a female, like it is a man and woman. Either way, it doesn't care. It doesn't care. It doesn't matter. But I definitely think there are three people involved here. Three of wands. I think Aries made a house with someone that he didn't really love or that Aries did really didn't love. And I think that Aries found someone that he actually really does love, but I think he's going to fight for the house because I think he has more material possessions there and it just wouldn't be wise financially to go, to go the love way. Wow. Okay. The Empress is behind the Three of Wands again. She's the mother. She's also Divine Feminine. And look, there's the Emperor right there. Interesting. Yeah. There's some kind of major, major masculine energy who is like in charge of everything. He takes care of everything in Aries' life. I don't really think it's Aries. I don't. I don't really think it's Aries. I think this is someone who controls Aries right here. I don't know who he is, but he controls Aries. Either way, Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine, if that is the case, they're split up. They're not together. They're far away. They're, they're very separated. What's coming in the near future for Aries? What's coming in the near future for Aries? Temperance reversed. Ten of Swords reversed. Ace of Swords reversed. Okay, so Sagittarius energy is coming in the near future. There's some kind of Sagittarius that possibly is drinking a whole lot. Um, it, it looks like he got ten swords put in his back at one point in time. So it looks kind of like maybe he was like metaphorically dead, at least in Aries' life. But he's coming back. And you know what? He's not going to tell the truth. He's not telling the truth. Anything else for Aries? Anything else for Aries? Anything else? Death. Temperance reversed. Um, it's kind of like the Sagittarius energy is coming into Aries' life and totally going to change this whole situation. Like there's this big Sagittarius energy influencing Aries' life. Uh, it kind of looks like they, it didn't seal the deal. Like it didn't totally, it changed Aries' life, but it wasn't final. It's like the Sagittarius is coming back. 
for the final transformation. They're going to come back to stay. Like, literally, they're coming back from the dead. Oof. Okay, well, this has been a reading for the Astrological Sign of Aries. I hope that it was helpful.